Hey everyone, Soundwave84 here. You tired of your Transformers being hollow? You feel like they don't come with enough accessories. So, what you can do is visit tfsafari.com and use these codes right here to grab some upgrade kits for your Transformers and save money while doing so. Everyone, Sally 884 here. The Transformers upgrade review. In this review, take a look at Matrix Workshop M73 uh, weapons accessory upgrade for your legacy skids. I want to say thank you to TF Safari for supplying this upgrade kit to review. Here is skids right here in all his glory. Now your uh, legacy skids comes with uh, this weapon here. It comes with this weapon here. And it comes with something like transparent blue plastic thing, which I have you know, just tossed somewhere, so I don't have that piece. I didn't really like that piece. But we have this here. These uh, do mimic. I can't hold on to things. Actual toys it came with in G1. Now, we do get a version of this weapon here in the Matrix Workshop upgrade kit, but we do not get a version of this weapon here. And this weapon here is sort of like that uh, missile launcher the G1 toy came with. So nowadays, they don't launch anything. You'll shoot your eye out, kid. So with the uh, upgrade kit from Matrix Workshop, you get this, which is reminiscent of this piece here. And we do know this piece here can combine with this piece here. And now that's his original weapons. We get this one here, and we also get this weapon here, which mimics something from the G1 cartoon, the uh, actual animation model. And you do get a combination out of this with this. And this piece here, you can see there's these little bitty, like, indentations. And that's where you're going to take the peg, and you will slide it there. And they'll go right there. And then you can put that peg here in his hand. Or in his forearm, sort of like the toy, how the toy weapons would clip around the uh, forearm or hand area. And then uh, well, you have this weapon here and it combines and it holds fairly well. It's not going to really fall apart. Now if you play with it, it will get a little loose and come out. You also get this weapon here, which is reminiscent of one of the weapons that uh, he came with in G1 as well. It's a nice long weapon. And yes, these things are uh, blast effect compatible. It right there on this one these work as well i think this one here is the only iffy one because it is a wider piece you'll have to really like shove it and then you might stretch the hole out and you know that's not always a good thing so you can combine these weapons here we'll peg them in his hand and do this one here you can peg it in his hand you can do his forearm However you see fit. And that is just some new weapons here for your legacy skids. Now it will also uh, work in vehicle mode where you can peg them into any ports. Here we go. I do have uh, the, I think his name is Burnout. And it is just skids with a new head and different colored plastic. There's that blue transparent thing I was talking about. You can take these weapons here. And of course, tab them in. To the vehicle modes just like so so now he is all armored up in a vehicle mode uh honestly this one doesn't look too good on the side let's put this one on the side right there we'll put this one up top that looks kind of cool up top i actually like that one up top i think it look even better on skids because the blue is a pretty good match to skids as you can see here now, all these weapon accessory uh, things here are 3D printed plastic. And these, God, I cannot hold on to that one. Yeah, these are painted. This is painted blue and painted black. And these two here are painted uh, silver. You can see here the, the white is still showing on these. And this one is not. They painted it silver all the way through. So here, just beware of the constant in and out. You could uh, get a little paint scra scrapage going on on the sides. But... Really cool upgrades. A quick video to show this upgrade kit for your legacy skids, or you can use it for your little Ossetron uh, burnout. Uh, but the blue here looks like, I mean, it's fine against the black, but it looks really cool next to skids because the blue coloring matches really well with the, uh, the blue that's actually on skids. I'll leave a link down in the description below where you can purchase this kit from tfsafari.com. Anyway, thanks for watching. Till the next one. Peace out.